Okay, I'm going to be reviewing the Frag FX for the PlayStation 3 system, and okay, here's what it looks like. Here's the mouse, and on the mouse, you have a left and right mouse button click, and the middle button is R3, left is R1, right is R2. And this button, if you see that button right there is start, and here is on the side the X, square, circle, and triangle. Yeah. Okay, I'm just going to plug it in here. And when it turns on, this button lights up. That's the PS button. And a left analog stick. And this is a frag button, so whenever you're sniping, you can, it moves your gun slower. This is L1, L2, select. D-pad and this is sensitivity right here goes from 1 to 9 1 being slowest 9 being fastest and I'm going to test it out on Call of Duty World at War so, I'm going to set my camera over here. Okay, hold on. Okay, there we go. I'm just gonna do free for all match, but I won't go through the whole match. Just I'll do a little bit just to demonstrate the frag effects.
Okay, that was just a little demonstration in Call of Duty War at War. So, and also one thing I forgot to mention is that this has a little cradle for it and you can move it um, left and right like that. One straight forward and one at an angle. So you can like position better. And now I'm going to show it in the web browser. <laughs> My favorite website, laststopcomic.com. Owned by Bobby Blakey. Okay, um, this left side controls the cursor. And this right side moves the page up and down or left and right. And. I guess I'll show in the YouTube video. Um, my subscriptions and stuff like that. Move up and down. Yeah, and that was my review of the Fag FX for the PlayStation 3. I gave it a 9 out of 10. So, it's a pretty good product. You should go pick it up. And there's going to be a version 2 of the Fag FX in February. So, it'll cost $80. So, look out for that. You get it from www.splitfish.com or www.amazon.com and that was my review.